Happy 4th of July. What better way to spend it than at Art Town? And we have the executive director of Art Town with us, Beth McMillan. Happy 4th. Happy 4th to you too. Art Town is stepping up big time for the 4th of July today. We are. We have two really big, beautiful performances tonight. What do we begin with? We begin with now Reno Jazz Orchestra, right? Right here. At Bartley Ranch. Right here at, at Bartley Ranch at the Amphitheater. A wonderful patriotic performance. And then at Wingfield Park, the Reno Philharmonic will be doing 4th of July patriotic performance over there. And they'll have fireworks over here. We will not have fireworks over at this venue because it's a little it's, hazardous. It's a little wildernessy. It's yeah. been dry, of course, and it's July. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so in a couple of days on Wednesday, July the 6th, tell us about Mono Blanco. So a friend of mine in New York, she is from Brazil. Okay. And um, she works in Central Park with Summer Stages. And I said to her, I want to bring a Brazilian artist to Reno, but I want like the real, like who's hot that everybody's going to just the authentic, whatever, whatever, you right. know? And she came back to me and she said, Mono Blanco. Had you ever heard of Mono Blanco? Never heard of her, but I contacted my friend Vivian, who runs the Lily Museum here in Reno, and I said, do you know Mono Blanco? She's from Brazil. This is quite the backstory. She Go on. Loved, she loves Mono Blanco. So with Vivian's like, you know, seal of approval, mm -hmm. We booked Mono Blanco and they're here on a huge American tour. Mono Blanco is an original like um, carnival band. They started out as a drum band, but there's tons of people on stage at Wingfield Park. Be there. Do they sing in Portuguese? Isn't that the native tongue of it Brazil? Is, it is the native tongue of Portugal. Yeah. I'm um, not Portugal, Brazil. Brazil. Brazil, right. yeah. Have you been to Portugal? I have why did last you have, year. Why did you have Portugal on the brain? Because you just got back? I got back last year. Do you have any November. Portuguese artists coming? Ever have there been one on, on our in our town? Yeah, yes, they have. But okay, we good. need to we need to do it again. So we're all inclusive then. Yes. Uh, Thursday, the next day, July the seventh. Girl named Tom. These folks are famous. You're talking. Yeah. This is a family affair. It is a family affair. It's, uh, it's three siblings, okay. and they just won the Voice. Right on our air. Right on your there air. You go. And it's two brothers and a sister. Okay. And the reason it's called Girl Named Tom is because when she was little, her brothers called her Thomas. Interesting. So that's why the trio is called Girl Named Girl Tom. Girl Named Tom. And for that event, everything else in our town is typically free. Mm -hmm. That is one of our headliners right here at Bartley Ranch. And so for tickets, go to arttown.org. And it's going to be a wonderful evening. And anybody who watched The Voice, and supported them, the, here's the opportunity to see them And when live. I heard their name, Girl Named Tom, I thought of Boy Named Sue, the Johnny Cash song, <laughs> right? Kind of a play there. And then Saturday, this is gonna be fun, July the 9th, right? We've got Pops on the River. Correct, and everybody loves Pops on the River. Again, that is not in Rancho uh, this year like it was last year. Mm -hmm. Back downtown in Wingfield Park, and um, back to Broadway. They're gonna be celebrating Broadway, so if you get a table, dress up like your favorite Broadway character. I'm going to Pops on the River. Can't wait. We'll see you there. And right. Then last but, but I have to tell you something okay. about that. Go ahead. And that is our table, mm -hmm. because you have to wear a hat at Pops on the River. It's okay. hot. It starts at 5 o'clock. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be doing My Fair Lady Day at the Races. Ooh, that's fun. So it's all hats and parasols and is that it. lovely? That's, that's fancy, just like you, Beth. Yes. And then a day of visual art, if that weren't visual enough. Oh, <laughs> my favorite day at Art Town, where you get to go around to people's homes in their backyards and purchase art that has been made by artists in our community and also regionally. I love it. And so that happens during the day, and then you go home and take a cat nap, 40 winks, and then wake up and go into Pops on the River. There you go. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Beth McMillan on this 4th of July. Yeah, happy 4th again. All right.